Okay, I switched libraries for my rotary encoder, now using Keats library, which I modified to compile an Arduino 1.0 plus. And also, Jim's program made a few changes to that so that uh, now compiles an Arduino 1.0 and above. Advantages to this is that it has asynchronous serial communication with buffering. And with Keats' new uh, encoder library, I'm going to turn this encoder right here without the use of any interrupts. And you'll see how quickly my heading will change. It's quick enough that it, the numbers you're reading are actually fed back from Flight Sim 10. So I'm using Flight Sim 10's own built in acceleration code for the uh, changing the autopilot settings. This is incredibly quick. Heck of a lot nicer than the old library I was using. And really makes the encoder a joy to use now, not a headache. So here's Flight Sim. See the heading change very quickly. So all in all, extremely happy with the results of using Arduino 1.0 and above and Keats uh, encoder library. It's a great combination.